Bill Duggan ride around on a hoverboard for the next 18 minutes and that'll make anybody <laughs> happy. All right, so we're gonna kick it off with an item we really haven't seen since the holidays. So it's a great time to have it back because it's a fantastic price break. If you want a super fun, easy way to just glide around town, you have to try the hoverboard. Now this one is the Air Ride Pro. So it's got more certifications, it's safer, it's smarter, it's a whole lot of fun and at this price, it's unbelievable because you're not only getting the hoverboard, you're also getting the backpack to make it easy to transport around town. $200 off for you today. We also have it on five flex payments of under $40, which is just insane for what has been and still is mm -hmm. one of the hottest gift items out there. Good morning, first Good of morning. all. If I can catch you, I'll say hi. <laughs> it's a great way but to start a Monday is the hoverboard, You know right? what? And even I'm thinking, okay, so graduates going on to college that mm -hmm. need a way around town. Father's Day, I can't tell you how many dads steal these from their kids. <laughs> right? Summertime, just an activity to get the kids outside during the summer doing mm -hmm. something fun. So many reasons to pick this up. You know why the dads pick it up too? Because the kids make it look so simple. Yeah. But I gotta tell you, what makes it simple is the technology in terms of the hoverboard experience. It's really the way, it's a self-bouncing board. The hardest okay. part is literally just standing on it and being able to not fall. But the cool thing is, the way it bounces, it just, if you can stand on it, you can really ride anywhere you want to go and it's so smooth and so intuitive. How do I go forward? Am I pushing, am I pedaling, am I, no. I just lean forward. You just lean. I just slowly lean forward and I'm off and running. How do I stop? I just shifted my weight backwards and it put the brakes on. I can even go backwards. Do you know how many times I tried roller so skating cool. backwards or ice skating backwards? I could never do it. And spinning is the exact same thing. You just shift your body weight to your left foot, to your right foot, and you're up and rotating. That's because of the gyroscopes on the inside. Another, did you ever try to roller skate in the house? Um, I don't know. Maybe when mom and dad weren't around. I, yeah, I was gonna say, I think I knew what would happen if I tried that. <laughs> exactly, but. <laughs> right? But the thing is, it was a clunk, clunk experience. Listen sure. to this. That's how smooth Amazing. and how quiet the ride yes. is for your son, your daughter, your granddaughter, or whomever you give this to, and it's a perfect time of year. It's yes. spring, but summer's gonna be here. The kids are gonna be looking for an activity. And we are including the backpack, this which is, is cool. great. Isn't it cool? Yeah. Because maybe you wanna throw it in the back seat of the car, because right. you know the kid's got a soccer tournament, but what's the other kid gonna take care of? You can throw it in the bag, take it upstairs to the dorm room or whatever, but more importantly, it's that easy, intuitive experience. The color's just the icing on the cake, and then when you see how simple and how user-friendly it is, yeah. you're gonna wanna get on well, it as well. it's interesting, because I don't see you leaning or going far. I no. mean, you, it's very much intuitive. Mm -hmm. And of course there's a learning curve like there was with your roller skates or your right. bike or your skateboard. But I'm telling you, once you get it or once the kids get it, they are off to the races, mm -hmm. just having a great time. You should read the reviews on this. Yes. It is amazing to see what people said. And a lot of them said, I got one for the holidays and now the sibling or my other niece or the other nephew wants one. So now's the time to pick it up. And that was just fantastic. it. They got it for one kid because it was more expensive. Sure. And now they can actually afford it to get it for the other kid or for their birthday, summertime birthdays. They're oh the worst, because you know, you yeah. always think about, oh, what am I gonna get them, what are they gonna use? And realize, you're talking about the learning curve. One thing, or there's two things that I really like about our pro board better than other ones out there. Okay. First, it's UL certified. That's really important. That means the battery life, it's gonna have better battery management, it's mm -hmm. safer to charge up, which, you know, we've heard about other issues out there, but sure. with our UL certification, you have peace of mind. Other thing is, remember we're trying to ride a bike? the training wheel experience. Yes. There's two user modes on our board. Oh. There's the beginner mode, which is great because you know maybe you want them to just creep along a little bit until they're a little more comfortable because this can get up to seven and a half miles per hour. That's awesome. That's an amazing <laughs> clip, right? That's and so, so cool. And so when they're ready for a little more speed, you can take it out of beginner mode and then all of a sudden they're just zipping around campus or ah, zipping around town. Okay. And that's really the peace of mind of you, your purchase in terms of our hoverboard today. Wow, fantastic. Okay, there are different colors to choose from. So on your screen, you're seeing that blue. It's just beautiful, like a cobalt blue. But you can also choose the red that Bill's mm -hmm. been riding around on or the black. And it comes with that carrying case as yep. well, which is a fantastic value. It's specifically designed mm -hmm. for this hoverboard. So you can exactly. take it around town with you. It's got a shoulder strap, which is nice. We are taking $200 off of the price for this. And it's on five flex payments. So, I mean, to think that you can get this home because when these first came out we're talking like four hundred dollars for this exactly. type of thing um, and they flew off the shelves they and that's flew. one reason why the ul certification wasn't on those original ones because they couldn't keep up with demand gotcha. but realize it's that self-bouncing board 
your range in terms of how far you can go, nine to 12 miles. I mean, that's my commute wow. in the morning. Yeah. But it charges up within 90 minutes of operation, gives you 90 minutes of operation, excuse me. And then you have the two to three hour charge time. So, I mean, really quickly charges up, but that seven and a half miles per mm -hmm. hour of speed, ours even include the lights, it includes the training wheels in terms of the two user modes, and then we throw in the backpack. But you see how it's designed. And I'll take you on a quick tour as well. You have the fenders, which I really appreciate because it kind of locks you in. It has the pedals, which is a nice large base. But realize when we call it a pedal, it's not really a pedal that you have to like pedal sure, on a bike. Like it's pedal. more just your foot pad. And within that foot pad itself, that's where you have a lot of the technology in terms of the sensitivity of being able to just roll forward, to roll backwards, to stop, to spin. And that's really where you see how intuitive it is. It's that simple. So again, I just want to show you, how do I pedal to go across town? I just lean. Simple as that. Am so I if you want to stop, what do you do then? I just shift my weight back to the trunk right here. Oh, okay. Things I want to go trunk. backwards, <laughs> same thing. I can go backwards, I can go forward. How do I spin? I just put a little more weight on my toes right up here in front. I want to go spin this way. I put a little more pressure down on my toes right down there. Yeah. And you asked earlier, how easy and how do you learn to get on and off? Everyone gets on and off the hoverboard a little differently. I like to hold on to something, whether it's the kitchen counter, the dining room table, or a chair, and then I can hold on to something and step on and off. And it just beeped. It just beeped, which is, it realized that I was getting, I was, the sensitivity is I'm not on it anymore. Mm -hmm. And realize, this has a nice weight to it, and so it's nice and sturdy, great construction. Ours has the headlights, which not every wow. version does, which is great, so you can see how it lights up. But see also how it has an axle in the middle? Uh -huh. We remember skateboarding. I mean, the skateboard went forward, the skateboard went backwards. Right. It didn't have that independent rotation, which also allows, if I put pressure on this wheel, I'm gonna be able to spin. I mean, see, I'm putting pressure on the front pedal right over here, put pressure in the back, it takes me backwards. That is so cool. And it's, remember, it's the self-balancing aspect that's great. And how do you get on and off? I put mine down, again, I like to hold on to something. Everyone does it a little differently. Um, you know Anthony Sullivan? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. One of the guests here, big guy. He actually likes to sit in a chair and then stand up right on oh. it. I, again, like to hold on. I like to use the fenders that are there up against the wheel welt. On the side I here. put my feet up against them so I'm kind of locked into place. And then, Remember, I have those two user modes. So I can be in beginner mode in the living room with mom and dad watching or you know, Uncle Bill taking them outside and holding their hands until they're comfortable and like, oh, you, you really got it, you're kind of good at this. And the next thing you know, you can put it on standard mode, which is like taking the training wheels off. Right. And that's where you really can open it up, have fun with it, take it out to the park. We're riding inside, but you can definitely ride this outside and it's still a smooth well, that's, experience. That's what I was gonna say is think about, you know, what's happening this time of year. So when summer comes mm -hmm. and maybe you've got grandkids or a niece and nephew coming to visit for the summer and you want something fun for them to be able to do to get them outside so they're not watching TV all day long, <laughs> this is fantastic. Maybe it's a graduate who's gonna be going off to college and they need a way to get around campus. Fantastic gift. I keep thinking Father's Day because I know mm -hmm. so many dads that would love this. They love their <laughs> gadgets and something fun to do and this is just totally different and unique so there's lots of reasons you may want to get it and again since the holidays were over you really don't see these if you no. missed it when they were you know in the mall and like a pop-up kiosk and then they disappear and then now what well now we've got them available we always have our 30-day return mm -hmm. policy so you can try them out and you know what I love get about that, that learning curve see I'm the uncle that kind of like spoil the niece and nephew yeah. or they come over to my house and so if you're watching right now get it now and then if you know mom's like no they're not ready for it then you can always send it back sure but you know this is what happened my mom was like that with me yeah. I wanted a skateboard and mom was like, no, no, you're not ready for it, and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I was ready. Yeah. Which I get moms and dads. She wasn't and... ready yet. <laughs> exactly. What age do you recommend for this? Actually, we have it. I think it's 14 and up is what we say. Okay. But the thing is, it's really per parental choice. And what it's yeah. great about it, too, is with the return policy, if you they're not coordinated enough, you can send it back. Sure. But when you see how easy it is, get them on the hoverboard, just stand them up on it. It's like, yeah. okay. And like, Bill, go forward. Okay, but you notice I'm not pedaling. I don't have to like balance myself. because the board. Yeah. Kids so I pick lean. up on things Boom. so fast, it's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. So if I am ordering this as a gift and I get it sent to me, what do I need to do to get it ready to run? Like, we how just do get we get it get charged up, which is great. But okay. remember, then you have that beginner mode, which is, it takes you through in the instructions. You hit the power button twice to put in beginner mode. Okay. But to go forward, you just lean forward. To lean back, you lean backwards. It's what's inside the technology. The outside is the fun color, the red, the blue, the classic black, but then when you see how easy it is to operate, that's where you're gonna, if it's too difficult to use, they're not gonna use it. Yeah, but when right. it is so easy and user friendly, and right. you know, the little kids see the big kids doing it, and then they wanna do it, and they can, that's why I was like, oh wow, we should have picked up another one. Yeah. And we also think about summertime, it's like how many bikes can you get in the backseat of the car? How many skateboards, and how point. many whatever. Right. 
It's the bag. You throw Let's the bag go out to in the, the park. Maybe yep. I'll ride my bike, and exactly. you guys can do your hover board, mm -hmm. and I'll be with you. Okay, I do want to pull the mom card here okay. and talk about <laughs> safety of this. Gotcha. Um, I know there's UL certification, but what exactly right. does that mean, and why does that matter sure. when it comes to safety concerns? And we talked about the training mode mm -hmm. already too. So we are very proud of our UL certification. That I want to show off that sticker right over here. It's rare, is it? Oh, it's not on this. Oh, there it is. It's on this side. And the thing is, that's important because it went through all the training right over here. So you can see that gold sticker right over here. Can you guys see? it which camera yeah I think is that go. gold sticker that UL certification what does that mean that means it's gone through all the, the certification that is required so when you do plug it in and charge mm -hmm. it up it's mm -hmm. safe and secure when you do expect to get 90 minutes of operation time you're gonna get 90 minutes of operation oh, time. That's a long time and that's really what you want I do love the fact that ours has a training wheel mode too so it has two modes of operation beginner which g g doesn't give you that full seven and a half miles of, of pep when you need it sure but then when you want it you can don't have to go buy another one or take off training wheels. It's just a press of a button. Look at the large foot pedals. It has a nice grooves on it too. So whether, you know, nice. they have wet feet from being on the grass or something like that, sure. they're gonna be able to just step right on it and just ride and roll, which is really what you appreciate. And look at that, a little pressure. I'm rolling and it's going backwards, it's going forwards. And I just appreciate the fact that one, we get this to you, we give you the carrying pouch so you can just throw it in the backpack, carry it over your shoulder, and take it to grandma's house, yeah. take it to the park, yeah. take it to a best friend's house, because maybe they have one, and now it's their chance to have one for themselves. See, and that's the thing. We already know this is a super cool gift idea. <laughs> we know it's a lot of fun. We watch you flying around here. Mm. But one of the big reasons I like something like this is if you've always wanted to pick one up and you've thought about it, why not get the one that's safer, mm -hmm. it's smarter, and it's a better value. This value is ridiculous, you guys. We took $200 off our typical HSN price for you. And then when you break that down on FlexPay, if you've never used FlexPay, all that does is break up your payments over time. So there's right. no interest, there's no gimmicks. You can use any card or PayPal, whatever it is. You spend $39.99 and your tax and shipping, we're gonna send that to you. And, try and then it. you just try it. You yeah. have 30 days to try it out or let your kids or your grandkids mm -hmm. or your niece and nephew try it, see what they think. And if you're not happy for whatever reason, send it back. No questions asked. I mean, it makes something like this a much easier decision to make because this could be something you see out at a mall or somewhere and you're like, first of all, it's about $400. Mm -hmm. What do I do if I, you know, ride it around and decide I don't want it? Am I right. stuck with it now? I mean, we kind of take all of that extra stress away so you can just get it and watch your kids light up or the grandkids. Mm -hmm. I mean, these reviews, I read <laughs> some of the fun. This one is probably my favorite. Bought this for my grandson, and I will just say I am his number one favorite person. He just <laughs> loves to ride it all the time. I mean, Major that's the kind points. of gift that's fun because mm -hmm. it's not always easy to know what to get the younger kids or the college age kids. But, I mean, this is a perfect graduation gift. I wish I would have had this. Well, when I, I was talked in about school. the bike riding. I talked about the, the skateboarding. I remember when I got those as a gift. I remember the oh, person who gave do. it to me, whether it was Christmas or my birthday. And you know what? The hours of fun I got on that, yeah. it was so much fun. The hours of fun I got outside of the house on that, which was great. I'd take exactly. it to my mom's house, my dad's house. That's another great point. I had, so my parents were divorced. I had a mm -hmm. bike at my dad's house, a bike at my mom's house. Cause it couldn't bring sure. it back and forth all the time. Yeah. With the case, with it being a smaller footprint, it is great. And the fact that we give you the bag is, is nice because it does weigh about 29 pounds. And I'm glad nice it does, it. considering what it is, it should be, you know, hefty. sturdy sure, and hefty. Exactly. Yeah. And remember, even though it's hefty, it's so user-friendly to use. You put it on the ground, you put the power button, which remember, push it twice, you get your beginner mode, push it once, you have your standard mode, and then the hardest part is literally just being able to stand on it. Yeah. And because the board balances itself. How do I propel myself? Remember, I'm not pushing, I'm not pedaling, I'm not trying to balance. I just really roll. How do I stop? I just shift my weight backwards and I can go backwards. <laughs> Were you a roller so cool. skater or an ice skater? Yeah, I did inline skating, okay. but yeah. I could never do the backwards thing. Too much I know, coordination. You try to like do it out. Felt like, goofy. I know, it was the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> and the thing is with this, I can go backwards. I never could do that before. <laughs> and it's literally just shifting your weight, yeah. which is just great because the way the pedals work, they're nice and large, which is great for larger feet or smaller feet, but just a little forward motion and I'm going forward. A little backwards, I have, I'm propelling backwards. And then the spin, it's literally almost just like you just creakle your toes and you're going in a different direction in terms of turning. So that's the pedals itself. But the features in our hoverboard, remember, this is that pro. Why? It's self-balancing and that's the hardest part is just standing on it. And then you get 12 miles in terms of distance. That's amazing. 90 minutes of continuous operation. I mean, I just want to be able to get across campus or you know get down to the, the clubhouse or the cul-de-sac, but I also appreciate 7.5 miles per hour. That's a yeah. great clip when you're, you know, are just trying to get around or have fun with it. Right. But remember, 
you have those two modes. So if you have the littler ones who maybe not, you're not ready for them to have that or full Or two operation. siblings different ages and you want them each to be on something else, or you which can is, do that. Actually, that's yeah. perfect. So maybe it's one hoverboard in the family. Yeah. And you have a nine-year-old and you have a 14-year-old. The 14-year-old's ready for whatever, <laughs> boom. The little one, put it on beginner mode. It's not an additional purchase. Hey, let me walk you through what you're getting and your choices. This is the red color, which Bill's been on. And it's a beautiful, like, cherry candy apple mm -hmm. red. So you can choose that. We also have the blue, which is that beautiful cobalt blue or if you like the black, we have the basic black, but all three of them are also gonna come with that carrying case. You can yep. wear it on your back like a backpack or you can wear it on your shoulder. There's a strap for that as well. I'm assuming space in there, you know, in case you wanna put the charger and different things, everything can stay together. Yes. But it all comes together, UL certified, which means it's been tested mm -hmm. for safety. So the moms and the grandmas we'll out there, that that? peace of mind right for there. sure. Mm -hmm. And then five flex payments. We took $200 off the price and we've broken it down to five flex payments. So again, if you are thinking about summer birthday gifts for that hard to gift, you know, teen or tween, if you've got somebody, you know, going off to college, if you just want a fun summertime activity to get outside and do something different, maybe it's for yep. the dads in your life. You know, we always joke it's dads and grads, you know, mm -hmm. graduation and Father's Day. Great gift for that as well. So if you've been thinking about it or you want to add a second, some of the reviews said I'm getting another, um, this is a good time to do it. And it's the thing a great is you value. Think about going across campus. You leave your bike outside if you're a college campus, but is it always going to be there when you go back to it? Because mm -hmm. people pick up the bikes. You or can take this on? up to your room. <laughs> oh, right. And then you got to ride a wet seat yeah. across Kicktown. But I remember actually being on campus and a uh, a friend was actually scooting across campus on a scooter. Scooters were big then. Yeah. And look up, it was actually, it was a priest. It was the funniest thing. Was he's a like, priest? a priest? I went to a Catholic university. Oh. And he's zipping like, along. It sounds like a bad joke. <laughs> a priest on a scooter. <laughs> well, I want to see a priest on one of these. Why not? That'd and the awesome. thing is, it's so easy and user friendly to use. Easy to bring it upstairs and charge it up, or maybe you take it to the office because this is how you're commuting. It's easy to get at home too and just try it out. Yeah. See how beginner mode is. See how sturdy your kids are, your grandkids are on the board itself, and then see how much. It, they're up and running because it is as easy as just standing on it and then not having to pedal and balance, but just yeah. shifting your weight forward, shifting your weight backwards. And this is another example. I love just showing everyone. Listen to how smooth this ride is. Okay. Because remember, there's other rides, your bikes even is like clank, clank, clank. Listen to this. That's nice. That's, that's, so that's cool. why it's, it's like it's riding on air. Yeah. Because it is just so user friendly and intuitive. I think back to that review you talked about with the, the grandma getting all the major points. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you how many times I've seen videos of people, you know, setting the table on their hoverboard because they can maneuver around the dining room, <laughs> sweeping up the living room floor because oh, they can do like that it. on the hoverboard. If it helps so with the funny. chores, <laughs> get it on. One of the other reviews, someone got it for a Christmas gift and while their kid was at school, it wasn't Christmas yet, they would take it out and play with it and then put it back. <laughs> so it's one of those things, like we keep mentioning teens and young adults, but listen, the grownups love it too. It's a really but easy learning curve as well. That's just it. If you just got it for the it. kid at Christmas, this is a great chance yeah. for mom to get one or dad to get one too. So I'm in. Together. It's a good way to start a Monday, that's for sure. Yep. You guys, that's item 511266 if you want to try that out. We've still got more to come this hour, so don't go anywhere. But here is some fun with scrapbooking. We'll be right back.